Yuma, I have seen you lose to a vending machine. Are you sure this is wise? Well, like every show involving Duki, he was bound to get a reboot at one point. Hello guys, welcome to the new Yu-Gi-Oh! Love Letter series, or, well, the Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu -Oh! FST, the Yu-Gi-Oh! Fan Series Tournament, where me, Duki, and Esco Knight will That's pair- me. hello. Will pair up characters from fan series against each other. So basically, if you guys don't know how this works, um, well actually, I mean, it's pretty obvious, like, um, so we'll be using a deck with a character from any fan-made Yu-Gi-Oh series, and we'll just be putting it against, the, putting them against each other to see which one does best. Um, usual fan-made making, well, deck making rules apply, like, um, only using the cards they actually used, and if there isn't enough, replicate, replicates are allowed, and all that. And to tie this into the previous Love Letter series, we're going to be doing a repeat of everyone's favorite character, Carlos, versus everyone's favorite protagonist to dump on, Fly. <laughs> well, fucking cum has returned, I see. Great, brilliant, <laughs> man. I get to kick his ass again. <laughs> Only to make this a little bit more interesting, we'll be using Sly's new deck from the reboot, Hard Heroes Crimson, and the one that he and the one that he used against Tom Alkman, the vi the Visor Knight archetype. All right, I'm gonna go first, mate. <laughs> oh my God! Boy, this hand sucks balls, mate. <laughs> it really does. <laughs> I'll set a card and pass. Very well then. I draw. So, point us out in our last Love Letter series episode, but like, Sly has the worst win loss ratio of any Yu Gi Oh! fan series character protagonist we've ever seen. The, only one, who, the only one who can match him could be Zack from Yu Gi Oh! Chronicles. Yeah. Sly has seven wins, six losses, and one tie. Bloody Zelo from GX Minecraft's a, a much more um, co competent pro protagonist than him. Um, anyway, I summon Great Phantom Thief in attack mode. Attack him directly! Oh no. And now I activate his effect. You see, I get to declare the name of a card when he inflicts damage. And if you have that card in your hand, it's discarded. I declare... Dark Android Cannon! Well, my cards may be revealed to you, mate, but you're wrong! Fine, I end my turn. Okay, I, I gotta do this just once. Ahem. I now summon Cyber Fucking Dragon! <laughs> <Ow>. <laughs> there, there he is, ladies and gentlemen. Carlos has summoned his Cyber Fucking Dragon! I, and. Attack the great phantom thief! Evolution burst! Oh dear. He turned into Sebastian Grey for a second. Evolution burst! Ah. <laughs> I can do a pretty good sign Sebastian too. Not I can bad. do a pretty good right. Zeke. Not bad, but there's a lot more where that came from. Okay. Draw! I set a monster face. I <laughs> summon Visor Knight Formos in defense mode. Improvise, adapt, overcome. <laughs> set and turn. By the way, I should mention uh, we don't know the full effects of a lot of these cards or even the full stats. So, th this guy, for instance, once per turn, he can't be destroyed by battle or card effects, but that's the only effect that was showed off. His attack wasn't even showed off, so this is all I have to work with for now. But when the reboot actually does come out, this will probably be changed mm -hmm. if we learn more about what their actual stats and whatnot are. If it are. ever does come out. Mm -hmm. Cyber yeah, Dragon, you. attack! Nice try, but my Fulmus' special ability means that once per turn, he can't be destroyed by battle or card effects. No, no way. Oh, yeah, we turn. didn't even know he has. How, how oh, could we possibly see that he summoned that? <laughs> I summon Visor Knight. Yang, mach Yang machine attack mode. Then Yagamashi. I activate. Yeah. Then I activate the spell V backlash. 
This lets me destroy cards you control up to the number of Visor Knights on my field. So your face downs are kaput. Aha! When my Overlimit Breaker is destroyed, all other spell traps go with it. But that doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Well, I guess it's a good thing I chose to I save mean, my remaining I, I, I guess now. the Backlash would be destroyed by the effect, and that would give Sidra 400 attack... Uh, permanently. Oh, fair enough. But that's so not going to matter. 2500. Well, fair enough. But that's not going to matter. Now I play the spell card, Omnistar's Gift. This lets me send both my monsters to the graveyard in order to fusion summon. I fusion summon. Pfizer Knight, over dark! Now, I activate over dark's ability. By removing one of the Pfizer Knights in my graveyard, I'm allowed to boost its attack points by 400. Tremble in fear as over dark destroys Cyber Dragon! Ow! <laughs> Damn, we lost another week. I set two cards face down and end my turn. And during the end phase, my over, my Overstar's Gift Other ability activates, forcing me to discard my remaining hand. Hmm. You know, from what I, from what I've gathered about this archetype, it focuses a lot on these gift cards, similar to how um, the volcanic card focuses, the volcanic archetype focuses on those blaze accelerators. You're focusing on gift cards, so you're telling me that they're Amazon? <laughs> Bro, this archetype was made by Jeff Bezos. I activate my... Oh. I activate my face down card. Roll of fate. Oh, brother. Oh, this oh I, roll didn't, I, didn't know, I, I didn't know Jaro Martinez was secretly part of this duel. And it cool. landed on a two. So that means I get to draw two cards and then banish that many that from the top of my deck. That means you got a free pot of greed! Now let me do that. <clears throat> a free pot of greed! Then, I summon Visor Knight Shining Warrior! And yes, his effect is question mark, because even though it was shown, I couldn't make out what it was. Uh, we, we've never seen his effect. Shining Warrior, attack him directly! Damn, we lost another week. Overdark, direct attack! I end my turn. Great, you put me in ruins! <laughs> ruins, you tired! Oh, this would have been great to turn a goat. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> well, what did you get? Did you get. Um... I, I expect soul release. Oh. Uh, bashing your other Vizor Knights, and, and your Phantom Thief. Fair enough. Then Monster Reborn to revive Sidra. Okay. Uh, Sidra will attack your Shiny Warrior. Urgh. And that is... Uh, okay, 300. Hmm. Is there a Shiny Warrior gains like a... <laughs> 200 attack for each Bizer Knight, so he was meant to be stronger or something. <laughs> that would be the funniest thing. Okay. I activate this month. I activate Overdark's ability once more, banishing my Shining Warrior to boost its attack points by another 400. Is that 34? I. You know, I swear this guy better have another effect. Like, when it actually comes. Anyway, attack Cyber Dragon! <laughs> Because if he doesn't, he's gonna be very weak. 1300, ow! And with that, I end my turn. <laughs> okay, I, I surrendered this round, S code. But I just want you to see what I had in my hand. Alright, come on, let's see it. So, I, I had Scarecrow. Yeah. Problem was, I need to control Dark, dark Android Tank for this effect. The only dark android I had in my hands was Knight, which can't be normal summoned. Damn. The other card was Slot Machine. <laughs> Thank you, random duel against Skullface. <laughs> and the card I drew... Oh. 
<laughs> Emperor Penguin. Yeah, the, the, the fucking Emperor Penguin put me in ruins, mate! <laughs> it put me in the fucking hospital, I'm now on life support! Oh, <laughs> it sent his Ashton army up. Le funny. Alright, uh. <laughs> oh, great. Great. Poggers, even. <laughs> what? Did you get an even worse uh, hand? I summoned no. the Boltman. <laughs> in my turn. <laughs> Very well, then. That's my move. I activate the dangerous machine type 6. And I oh, yes. Yeah, so special. That's only during your standby phase. It landed on a five, so I get to destroy one monster on your field. I can't bolt in the standby phase. Oh. Sly Light was in the episode. He was playing the anime version oh, or something. Right. Oh my. Oh. I, I right. It would have been the anime version. Oh, so shall I just? Oh, okay. Fair <laughs> enough. Now yeah, we're just and playing then... by the actual like of what uh, was uh, how it was used in the you know shows and whatnot was the appeal. Draw. Oh, all right. All right. <laughs> I summon blast fear. <laughs> <laughs> An attack! You attacked my Viper Knight Formos, who can't be destroyed! And I take 200! Well, Damn, yeah, you lost another I... You know, if it makes you feel better, um, this hand isn't really that good for me either. I kind of. Alright, <laughs> uh, time for you to roleplay Joey Wheeler. Very well. Go, my dangerous machine! Five. Five. So your blast sphere is destroyed! Right. <laughs> Next, I activate another dice spell. The Roll of Fate! <sighs> Gyro leave? A one. Okay. I draw one card and then vanish one. Since when did Sly become so obsessed with luck cards? I, I don't know, I, but this I, is I, what I don't he think ran there was a problem. thing in the original card, Heroes. No, he had literally no cards that roll dice or anything like that. Well, this is what he ran in the crossover, so that's what I'm going with. Mm -hmm. Should've renamed Visor Knights to Lucky Knights, because holy shit. Eh, <laughs> it, it, got it, nothing it, else. It, I end my it, turn. It's going to be luck if they even ah, win a duel. Oh shit, finally a good card. I summon the Dark Android Blade! And not the first, and that was randomly a normal monster. <laughs> Now he'll use his ability to resurrect the boatman. What the heck is with your voice? You don't make any sense. Listen, mate. Your mum. Anyway. <laughs> Blade will attack Flamos. Not so fast. I activate a trap card. Rising energy. Now, by discarding a card from my hand, my monster gains 1,500 extra okay, attack points. so here's the deal, mate. My bomber is a suicide bomber, apparently. And what that means is that he can blow himself up and destroy your rising energy and negate that shit as well. What? No! Well, at least my monster can't be destroyed by battle. He destroys it anyway. How? <laughs> Dark side meme, you still take the damage. Yeah. But you still take the damage! <laughs> you still take the damage! My move. Hmm, interesting. I activate my dangerous machine! Looks like Lady Luck's on my side. <laughs> I get to destroy a monster on your field. I choose your dark android blade. Rocker. Then... Hmm. S code knight, more like five code knights. <laughs> well, five is my favorite number. Oh, makes sense then. Bonkers! <laughs> Battle! I shall attack you directly! Yeah, that checks out. Your move. This is what Yu Gi Oh should be. <laughs> Drake, do you have more copies of him in the deck? No. Oh, nay. I Dark Android tell you! <laughs> I end my turn! <laughs> try beating my you teddy bear! You yeah, try beating anyway. my teddy bear! You won't! 
Oh, I will. Go, my dangerous machine. Are you fucking I'll kidding me? Apply once more. <laughs> Number five, we're alive, and I shall sacrifice my monster to summon Visor Knight, Max Blader. And when this card is tribute summoned, it gains 300 attack points. I know it says 500, but that's a foul up on my part. Anyway, attack him directly, Visor Knight. Oh, joy. And with that, I end my turn. Oh, brother. <laughs> Seriously, though, this... Like, this Sly is a, is actually competent. Like, he's much more competent with this deck than he was with- the, I am going to set know. a card and pass the turn! <laughs> uh, that episode would have been much different if you just used, like, new- The Pfizer Knights, like, yeah. One. The problem is that the only thing we have of Crimson is the crossover. That's the only thing we have. Eh, that's unfortunate. Attack you directly, my knight! Yeah. Bro, the alternative universe works. What, I'll not attack with Shining Warrior and give you one more turn. See what you do. Oh, great. The oh, great. Wait, wait. <laughs> we have them both. No, Dookie, read it. Wait. Tyler, I want to thank you for your poor choice of wording. What the fuck? I summon the Dark Android Scarecrow. Okay, and what's going on? Then I activate Legacy of the Forefathers. Wait, what? It actually works. And what? I'll sacrifice my Scarecrow to summon Dark Android Emperor Ascendant. Wait, well that works on. Oh, good luck. It's any monster because the way Tyler worded it. <laughs> <laughs> What a comeback. <laughs> Carlos, comeback time, baby! Oh, Murder! Hold on, okay, let me do so. Oh, you're dead. You're dead! Why, what does he do? Battle face, I attack your shiny Drake. warrior with Ascendant, and then- Drake, 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 let me usher in the words. <clears throat> Damage step? Damage yeah. step? I activate Limitor removal! <laughs> Good lord. Uh, uh, I activate... I discard extra tick. What? This monster negates your attack. Wow. Oh wait, no, that only what? Wait, no, wait. When your opponent's... This card is unaffected by your opponent's card effects. That doesn't work. But it all, well, well, yeah, also it only works when you attack me directly, so... Go, go, yeah. back, go back to the Emperor. Mm. Yeah, even even if it didn't, okay. like, I even said, if I it thought, wasn't. I thought it said leave the field, so I thought that said, like, unaffected by card effects that make it leave the field specifically, but no. Also, why am, I getting a sense of, why am I getting a sense of deja vu right now? <laughs> because of Tyler, we get a game free. Let's go. <laughs> For miraculous means, I've turned the Scarecrow into a god card. Fuckers. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, am I going first? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's king. I'll start by summoning Sakura Samurai 4, and then I end my turn. Draw. <laughs> Strongest Lahito board. Alright, I'm going and to yes. summon the Dark Android Core Man. Alright, wait, first. Uh, Cyber Fucking Dragon! <laughs> you can't. No babies, backsies. Then Core. Activate core to summon from deck Dark Android Soldier. And soldier's effects of special summon Dark Android Knight. Sadly, your Sasuke Samurai is not a machine. Damn. We love you. I am. Discard balance monster, that's quite good. If you color right, destroy the opponent's monster with this effect. I see. Are you a gambling man, Drake? Sure. Night Nightmen will attack Sasuke Samurai number four. Here we go. Here we go. What do you call? Here we go, buddy. Here we go. 
Oh, okay. I call heads. Heads always shreds. Mm. Oh, no way! His his luck ran out. Ah, uh, so uh, okay. So knight's attacking. So that's. Uh... I believe right. it's 1100. Yeah, I was right. Yep. Okay, yeah, damn it. Then 1400 from Soldier. Attack him with Scratch. <laughs> then Cyber Dragon. And I'm gonna hit you with the Boom Bam Bop. The Dark <laughs> Angel Combination card. Oh, no, that's not good. I'll fuse. Knight, Soldier, Sidra. Cord and the blade in my hand. Wait, what's coming at? Oh, wait. Summon the Dark Android Emperor. <laughs> However, he deals only half the damage. Yep. So you take only two thousand from this. Now attack him with Fluxion Force. <laughs> oh, finally, the uh, or original accurate duel. All right. Let's see. That uh, was an amazing hand. <laughs> And I'll say, um... I set a I monster like face down and end my turn. Alright, okay, draw. Oh, fuck. Oh, that is nothing. Okay, Emperor Seven attack! Minutes. Fine. You're attacking my Visor Knight, Fuck! Fal <laughs> Falmos, who cannot be destroyed by battle. Oh, Giant great, robot. my turn! Giant robot stopped by this fucking visor-bearing stick man. Sorry, pal, but I'm gonna make sure you don't get a next turn. What? Now I. S what? But. How? Well, in due time, I summon this Visor Knight Ronge. Then I tune my two monsters together in order to synchro summon Visor Knight Drill Bit. Oh. oh. Uh, yeah. In defense mode. Then. I'll set a card and end my turn. I'm still playing defense. Your move. I activate Weird man. the foolish burial. I'm gonna send a uh, slot machine to the grave. So we don't break. Yeah, exactly. Why I... did Carlos play foolish burial anyway? Uh... I mean, probably to set up the graveyard for Dark Android Blade or for his. Um... Soul release plus escape from the yeah. different dimension combo. All right, All right. fair enough. The mystical right. space typhoon of Fantasia. Ah, oh, no. Good thing I summoned my monster in defense mode. Not that this trap would have helped at the moment. Now, Flaxion Force! Urgh. Drill bits effect activates. You see, since you destroyed it by battle, I can banish a Visor Knight from my graveyard to summon it back to the field. Brilliant, mate! I get to kill him again now! Actually, you won't get the chance. I summon Visor Knight's Stray Warrior! Using her effect, she can resurrect another Visor Knight from my graveyard. However, its attack points are reduced to zero. Return, Ronge! Now I use my two monsters to construct the overlay net. Work. Xyz summon Visor Knight Mad Bomber, and I activate my monsters' effect by using up both its overlay units. Your monster is automatically sent to the graveyard. Then I get to draw one card. If what it's are you a doing, monster, man? You, you take just killed my dog emperor. <laughs> If it's a monster, I take 300 points of damage. But if it's a spell or trap, then you take 300 points of damage. Unfortunately, it's a monster. So, seriously, what kind of effect is that? I don't know. <laughs> More luck stuff. More luck stuff, I guess. Which my monster? Eh. I switch drill bit to attack mode, and now battle phase. Drill bit, attack. Yeah. Matt bomber, attack. Right. End turn. Ooh. Okay. Uh. Huh. <laughs> hmm, how can we cheese this? Hmm. I mean, there's not really a way to. 
I'll just summon Cydra. And then attack your quick bomber with Cydra. Also, Sly like he got, uh, Carlos got an turn. Evolution Blast! <laughs> Sebastian! I am my turn. Well, it's a good thing that Cyber Dragon won't. Well, that Cyber Dragon won't be on the field for long. Ugh, where were you so many turns ago? I play <laughs> Roll of Fate! If he rolls a five, I sure it does. It's luck time. Three. Okay, so three. it's a three. Or that means I draw three cards. I then banish three cards from the top of my deck. The funny thing is that roll of fate isn't even a luck card. Like even if you roll a one, it's still good. Because if you roll a one, it becomes an upstart goblin. Especially because this is not how, uh, how the card works. Because remember, it's supposed to be sent into the graveyard. Hmm. I set one card face down, and then... Hmm, I summon... I summon the Great Phantom Beef! Oh boy. Battle! Drill bit! Destroy Cyber Dragon! Phantom Thief! Attack him directly! Oh boy, what are you gonna name? And then... Hmm... I'm gonna take a gamble and say... Limit to removal. Nope! Got my hand to Soldier! Oh, whoa. Oh, oh well, okay, okay, yeah, fair, wait. Soldier. Oh no. Oh no. Oh... <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. Oh no 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 Scratch! Attack him with Scratch! I I discard extra tick. But your attack is negated. Great! I am my turn! My move. Christ alive. <laughs> right, let me do a whole anime thing. I s oh, You were baiting me this entire time! Correct! Now battle! Go, drill bit! Attack! Destroy his dark android soldier! I special summon the dark android scarecrow to negate the attack and end the battle phase! <sighs> well, I'm not going to risk it this time. I switch my Great Phantom Thief into defense mode. Turn it! Oh no, he, he, he didn't forgore. Okay. Alright. Soldier will attack your Great Phantom Thief. Ugh. I, uh, I passed the turn. <laughs> my move. I flip summon my visor knight, young young Ama whatever his name is, and activate his effect, adding another, adding one gift spell card to my hand. I can't even I see the wi the time wizard gift, and this actually doesn't have any art, but um, mm -hmm. well, I just gave it like the scene where Yuki gives Joey time wizard because right, whatever we, anyway. we we do whatever we can. And just because I can, I'll summon my stray. I'll summon another stray warrior and use its effect to resurrect Visor Knight Raj. Then I play my face down card, Omni Star's Gift. I fuse oh these two monsters together to create Visor Knight Over Dark. Not again. <laughs> I activate his effect. You already know what it does. I banish a Visor Knight monster from my graveyard to give him 400 extra attack points. Goat over Dark, destroy the Dark Android Soldier! No, mate! <laughs> now your skin's about to be burning. Stray Warrior, destroy the Scarecrow! Over Dark, drill, drill bit, attack him directly, and end this duel! No, no! Way, no. <laughs> Carlos has beaten 
Gauls has been beaten by Sly! <laughs> because this time we gave Sly a competent deck. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh man, these guys were fun. No, really, what? these guys. What a duel! Aye, uh, and if you want to play these Visor Knights yourself, y you now can, because they're on Dueling Book. Mm hmm. <laughs> Alright, uh, this was the first episode of the Yu Gi Oh! FST. See you guys for the next one. Bye!